So now that I have my animals functionality, I'm going to start creating some forms. Now the first type of form I'm going to create is a concept, and this is the most common form type you'll create in your application. And essentially a concept is used to create instances of records. I'm going to create concepts of type pets. Now what I want to do is I want to at least capture the name of my pet. So I'm going to add a field definition. And in the top left corner of my form, I'm going to basically ask for the name of my pet. So it's going to be a simple field of type string. And its XML element name in the database will be name. It's going to be a single line string and it's going to be a required field. Now I need to define the life cycle of my pet. For this example, I'm just going to create my pet in the active state. And to make that the default state of my pet record, if I go back to my form, the last thing I needed to do for a concept form is define a default instance name. And what I do here is I select from the field that I declared on my form what values I need to pull into my instance name. I only have a name field, so I'm just going to select the name as the instance name of the pet. And that's it. That's all I need to do to define a concept type of pet with a single field on it called name and a very simple life cycle where I start in the active state. 